typically only two pins, which are located here and here, that have to get knocked out. There's a spring that keeps pressure on the brake pad itself, and then we can pull that out and the pads will slide right out. And there you go. Use our caliper spreader tool to make sure that we compress the pistons back into the caliper so we can get the new thicker pads back in. Take the pad and slide it right back in there. And then I can go ahead and put the top pin through. See if I can do this without blocking the camera. I don't think I can for the bottom one. And that's it.